Good morning guys and welcome back to the Sullivan family. It's Sunday. What a difference a day makes. What a difference a day makes. Still a little bit windy, a little tiny breeze of wind, that's all. Nothing major, but it's definitely a lot calmer this morning than what it has been. Yesterday was unbelievable. Nice, isn't it? Right, I'll get you back at the house. Well, the weather is a lot calmer now than it was yesterday. A lot calmer. Um, it lasted till about, I'd say about seven or eight o'clock at night and then it kind of calmed down. So um, yeah, kind of glad, glad of that to be honest because that went on for a good couple of days. Storm Babette, um, not as strong as Storm Arwen when we had Storm Arwen. That was that was pretty bonkers, to be honest. Storm Arwen, um, yeah, blew fences down, blew a fence, blew the fence down. If you remember in our old house, Storm Arwen, literally flat, um, blew loads of fences down, caused loads of quite a bit of damage to quite a few properties actually. But uh, this one wasn't too bad, and I'm glad we got the garden prepared for winter. I'm glad. Anyway, lots of stuff going on uh, in the Sullivan family house this morning. Uh, I've got to take Elizabeth to work in a minute. It's What time is it now? It's half past nine in the morning. Say hello. Hey. Are you all right? Yeah. Yeah? You've been busy already. They've been doing lots of crafting and stuff this morning, haven't you? I made stickers. She made stickers. She made stickers this morning. But you know that thing when you lose the edge of the tape? You know that thing when you lose the edge, edge of the sticky tape on the roll and, and the children come to you and go, can you find the edge? Yeah. I've done that about 10 times this morning, haven't I? Yeah, haven't I? But have you had a nice time anyway? Good. Right, yeah, a few things going on this morning. Uh, I've got to take Elizabeth to work in a minute. She's working again at 10 o'clock in Lossy Mouth. It's about half nine now. We've got everybody breakfasted and dressed and all that kind of stuff, so that's all done. That's good. Uh, Zoe's made a start upstairs. She's doing the little one's bedroom today. Getting that done. I have no clue what I'm doing. Um, I've already fixed the stair gate this morning because that came off the wall. What I've realized is this house is like an old style granite Scottish house, you know. So what they've done is they've battened the walls and put plasterboard over the top. So when you actually attach things to it, so like when I tried to put that massive shelf up there that weighs about 15 kilograms, it just went, no, I'm not holding on to that. Even though I put, um, I put the old plasterboard plugs in. But it's the same upstairs to so the stair gate. Kids can't help themselves can't even a stair gate. They'll, they'll, they'll kind of push down in it by accident or whatever. And but I've, I've, now just, I've now just put um, bigger rule plugs in and I've just put screws in that long. So hopefully, um, oh yeah, by the way, I cut myself. Um, yeah, so I've put screws in that long and then hopefully that'll keep it on the wall upstairs. So that'll be good. Cause we need to keep that stair gate upstairs for Florence. So I've done that this morning already. I wanted to go and start down at the, um, down at the, the sea line because just just to show you that how much has changed. Yesterday was bonkers, today, calm. Just a little tiny breeze, that's it. So anyway, the plan for us is to get a few things done this morning like we always do on Sunday. We'll get a few things done this morning. I've had to cancel the tip run. I was gonna go and do a tip run this morning, but I have no car and I'd booked that car for the tip run specifically because you have to put the registration down and the car's in lost mouth. So picking that car up tomorrow, fixing the car tomorrow. So I've rebooked the tip run for Tuesday morning so I can go and take some bits and bobs and some rubbish and stuff before we go away uh, down to Carbridge. But this afternoon, what we really want to do, what I really want to do is to get down the woods, uh, the Rose Isle woods here, just literally walk across the road to go into the woods like we normally do, to go through the campsite. Because I want to see what kind of damage, we, we all want to go and see what kind of damage um, Storm Babette is done and also to see if anything's been washed up on the beach because that's quite good fun. Um, normally you get like trees that have washed down the river and all that, all that kind of stuff so it'd be fun to go and have a look and see if uh, st what kind of things Storm Babette has done to the beach so that'd be good. So Sunday in, an, in a roundabout way it's just going to be again it's just going to have a chill out day we're just going to get a couple of things done but we're going to finish off the day down in the woods just checking it out maybe go down on the beach a little bit as well just have a quick look um, <clears throat> and see what's happened. So that, guys, is your roundup for Sunday. Okay, so we've just dropped Lizzie off at work. 
uh, Toby's with me. Say hi, Toby. Hi. So just wanted to have a quick look at Lossy Mouth because I know Zoe did a lot of filming down here yesterday. Um, and we just want to see what it's like now. So which, uh, there is a, a whole sandbank over there. Hang on. Hang on, we'll show you. So the water is still really high, isn't it? Look. Yeah. Look. That water is really high. Look how fast it is. Right, you wouldn't want to go swimming in that, would you? No, you would huh? go into the sea. I mean, it's a lot calmer now, mm -hmm. but I don't know if you can see just across the way there. Let's see if I can zoom in. That's a whole new sandbank created. And that wasn't there. From the storm. And that wasn't there before, was it? Has Storm Babette gone yet? Yeah, I think Storm Babette's over now, but that's a whole new sandbank. And the waves pole. are still what, the, the waves are still big out there. Yeah, I know I can see it. It is really calm. I really like it this morning. It is, it's really nice, isn't it? This is the good thing about coming down to this beach in the morning when it's so calm. Look at the waves. I know the waves are huge, aren't they? Mm -hmm. They really are big. So it's yeah. Calmer from the other day. It's a lovely scene, though. Yeah. The other day was smashing into the walls, smashing everywhere when we were getting tiny. There was a bunch of foam over there. It was. Sea foam. The waves hit so hard that I destroyed some of the stone off this. So yeah, we thought we'd just give you a quick update on Lost Your Mouth as um, Zoe did a lot of filming down here yesterday, but it's uh, it it's definitely a lot yesterday. calmer, isn't it? Yeah, it was way more mental yesterday. It was, it's crazy. Right, we're going to head off to the co-op because we're going to pick a couple of things up for our walk this afternoon, yeah. aren't we, Toby, yeah? Yeah. Yeah? Cool. Should we go? Mm -hmm. Let's go. Right then, let's get some cookies. Mm -hmm. Cookies first. Yeah. See if you can find some of them little gingerbread men as well. Yeah. Those ones are the top of these. These ones are doing it. Get five of those ones. And, and five, five of, of these. Ones. Five of these ones. No, I get the chocolate okay. ones. And then see if there's any little gingerbread men. You got those? Okay. That'll do, won't it? Mm -hmm. Got them? Yeah. Good. Right. So let's go and get some drinks. Right, well, have they got, any, got anything on the sale, have they? Fruit shoot, hang on, they might have a sale on somewhere. Yeah, get two of those because they're on sale, aren't they? Those two. Right, I'll carry those if you want, Toby, yeah? Yeah. I'll get those ones. Again. <laughs> Are you alright there? Yeah. Right, let's go pay for it all, shall we? Yeah, it's Isn't it the bag? It's Halloween, isn't it? Yeah. Halloween is coming. Will we go pumpkin fishing again? Yeah. Yeah. I love it then. Right, Toby, are we done in Lossy Mouth? Yep. We're going to go home? Yep. Cool. High five. We're going home. Okay, guys, so my job for this morning is to change these beds they've got a triple bunk i love changing these beds i really don't change I don't love it at all so obviously erin is is that erin erin is now on the top bunk because they swapped when agnes was ill erin is now on the top bunk leah's on the middle because she likes being in the middle agnes is now on the bottom which is better really so like i said my job for this morning is to change these beds and tidy up a bit because it's a bit of a mess. That over there in the corner, by the way, I don't think I've mentioned that on any of our vlogs. We've bought a little bed for Flo because obviously she's still in our room and 
she's still going to be in our room for a little bit to be honest because she's just she's just not a good sleeper and um i'm worried if i put her in here she's going to wake all them up but it'll happen it will have to happen at some point i know but for now i've got her this bed which hasn't got a mattress on it yet it's just got these big i've got these big bean bag cushions um that they sit on but it's it's the same size as a cot so you can get them i got it from amazon um you can get them in different sizes you can get cot cot bed and single size but obviously we couldn't fit a single size in only was only enough room for a cot so um obviously she will come in here we'll probably just i've not done it before where we've made the transition from not only from room but from cot as well so i figured if we've got it in here because she comes in here to play so i figured if she's in here and she's got that there with a mattress and everything on it. I haven't got a mattress yet. Um, she'll get used to being on it anyway. And then eventually when she comes in here, she'll be used to being on it. That's the plan. Of course, we all know that that's not how it will happen, but that's the plan. So yeah, that's what that is in the corner. Those, those cushions, absolutely brilliant. So anyway, I'm gonna get on. I used to wake up with that confidence. Till I woke up with you right by my side I didn't think that you would show up Like you did and you turned my life upside down Oh, your love has got me high I never wanna say goodbye It's like my world's on fire Like my world's on fire This is where we're meant to be Singing to this melody Oh, this melody So sing, 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 sing So sing, 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 sing Oh, your love has filled my heart Blow my mind next to you I feel fine Oh, your love's got me high I don't wanna lose you now Lose this dream Making this melody Right, so the beds are done. Agnes has done all her teddies on her bed. There's more teddies. There's she has many more teddies. Believe me, it's her favourite thing. So she's put them all very neatly back on her bed. Um, I love the triple bunk. It's brilliant. Obviously, this used to be the boys in the old house, um, and I do love the triple bunk. But gosh, I it's just up and down up and down. it's really high it's it's really high up there i'll tell you that it's really high and it's a workout it's a workout getting up and down like a hundred million times to put all this stuff but it's done and it looks nice and neat and tidy for about three days and then it'll just you know so i'm going to give the rest of the room a um a bit of a hoover and a clean up tidy up obviously again it's not like finished in here there's no pictures up or anything yet i haven't got that far um but we're getting there the difference in weather today is crazy look at out there today you can't really see it actually but it's sunny and the sea is calm i'm even going to put my washing on the line it's just crazy how quickly the weather can change obviously um i had to take uh olivia at we left about four this morning to take her for the bus to go down to glasgow for a comp so it was a pretty early start it was half past three and actually when i got back this morning i got back about quarter to five and normally everyone's starting to stir or the little ones are starting to stir 
everyone was still asleep so I thought I might get an extra hour's sleep so I crawled into bed and just lay there couldn't go back to sleep <laughs> couldn't get back to sleep and then by the time I was starting to get a bit sleepy Florence decided she was going to wake up so it must have been about quarter past five so then she was awake so I tried to sort of like bring her in the bed and give her a cuddle but about 10 minutes and she'd had enough then um so yeah it's been an early start this morning but just driving on the roads this morning because I was a little bit concerned being that they were so wet and flooded yesterday you wouldn't even know you wouldn't even know that we'd had all that rain it's just insane how quickly it can change um but anyway I am gonna go see if my washing's finished and finish up this room and then I think we're heading for an early lunch because I need to get back to pick Lizzie up from work at three and we want to go for a bit of a walk um into the woods so we're gonna have early lunch and then go out earlier this afternoon for a bit of a walk. I will just add that I have been taken over by washing. I've got two loads waiting downstairs. I've got two full baskets there. I've got bedding and another basket there. And then I've got another basket behind there. So for anybody that thinks I keep up with the washing, I really don't keep up with the washing. I'm quite glad that the weather is nice for the next few days because I need to wash it and put it on the line. I don't like going away and leaving like loads of dirty washing line around. So my aim is to get through as much of it as I can over the next couple of days. But equally, I'm really tight, so I don't like using my tumble dryer too much. So if I can get it on the line, it's even better. So um, that is my challenge for the next few days, as well as kind of tidying the house and packing, is to uh, get through my washing. Wish me luck. Okay, guys, we're back. So it's about, well, it's nearly 11 o'clock now. Hi, everybody. Say hi. hi. What are you used to doing? Colouring. Colouring? Yeah. Cool. Joseph's just chilling on the sofa. He doesn't want to be filmed. He, he, he's, he, he just wants to be left alone for a minute. So we'll leave him alone. Hi, everybody. Hi. Are you all right? Yeah, looking at Christmas food. <laughs> Christmas food? Yeah, like, like little, you know, um, make it. Christmas picky bits. <gasps> oh, hello. Hi. Florence. Hi, right, Baba. Say hello. Say hello. Florence having a sleep. She had a sleep. Did you have sleeps? No. Bless her. Um. So upstairs, people are just chilling out in their bedrooms. Noah's doing his Sunday tidy up. I will, I'll leave them to it. I was going to go up and say hello. Oh, sorry. Oh, all right. Noah's doing his room. Noah's doing his room, isn't he? Mm -hmm. So Noah's started to do his bedroom on a Sunday now. It's really, really helpful. So the girls do their own room. Noah's now started to do his own room. So he gets a little hoover out and starts hoovering up and all that kind of stuff. So that's really, really helpful. Um, I'll leave them to it. I was going to go up and film, but I'll leave them to it. Um, but what we're going to do now, so we're going to do an early lunch. So we've got to pick Elizabeth up at three o'clock. So we're going to do an early lunch. No snacks this morning, just an early lunch. Get that cracked. So then we're going to go out for that walk. Uh, and then obviously we'll be popping up then about quarter to, or 20 to three to pick Elizabeth up. So, Belle, we're going to get on with an early lunch then, are we? Yeah. All right, Belle's, Belle's all over it. She's all over it, so I'll give her a hand. Right, guys, uh, early lunch, and then we'll be out for a walk. Yeah. Babe, why can't you see? No hope in what's left of me. I had to tell you before I fall asleep. Sitting there on the edge, babe, not knowing which way to lean.
tripping all over me Tripping all over you, babe Tripping all over me Okay guys, we're down at the Wiz. We're down at our now all-time favourite walk, which is this one. And it looks absolutely stunning today with the light coming through. Yes, I know, I know. There's red squirrels, I know, I know. Is there squirrels? Okay, I'll be quiet then. Because there's red squirrels down there, which is why it's so quiet. So this has now become our favourite, favourite walk. And it just looks lush with all the sunlight coming through. Um, we haven't seen any trees come down yet, so I don't think the wind was probably that strong or it was strong But not as strong enough to blow trees down, but there is lots of debris on the beach, which we've just seen We had a quick check of the beach um, Yeah Haven't seen anything majorly dramatic yet. So but we just wanted to come out and have a look And just come out for a walk as well. Have you seen any red squirrels? Have you seen any of the red squirrels, have you? No. I heard flying shouting at the end. Squirrels? Yes. Okay. Can you see them? That'd be very secret. Apparently there's squirrels in this bit. We found another bit. So in this bit there's squirrels, apparently. Red squirrels. No, it's a uh, it's a uh, pine cone. Pine cone. Show me It's a pine cone. Do squirrels like it? Yes, squirrels squirrels will break them apart and eat them up like nuts yeah they will and i bet they've probably got some nuts buried around here as well have you seen a squirrel yet we're going to see if we can find the squirrel Monkey. Hello. 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 <laughs> Florence, where are we? There we go. Florence. We're in the woods. We're in the woods. <laughs> 
We're in the woods. <laughs> oh no, don't stop it. <laughs> this is um probably fast becoming one of our favourite places to walk. Honestly, it's so beautiful. So we quite often go to Rose Isle um, over the years and it's beautiful and we've always loved it because obviously you've got the beach and the woods and this is like the other end of Rose Isle obviously we're in Boghead um, you can walk all the way through to, Bo uh, to Rose Isle but it's just so beautiful I mean look it's just like this the whole way through and I mean you can at the beginning bit you can uh, go on the beach as well it's a bit steep with the buggy but it's just it's just beautiful it's so peaceful it's just lovely What you got? Have you got two sticks? It's horses, look, Florence. Do you mind being filmed? <laughs> Say hello to the pony then. Ponies or horses? Horses. Horses. Oh wow, look at that. Oh yeah. <laughs> Who wants a seat up here? <gasps> You're joking. <laughs> Somebody will have to lift them. Come on, right, quick. Who does? Here you go. Hold you on to that now. No, hold on to that. Yeah. Hold on to that. Where are you going? Right, who's lifting me up? I'm not. I'm not. Dad. Right, ready? Three, two. I'm going to lift you up this way. Dad. Three, two, one. Sam, leg over. That's what I say to all the boys, leg over. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Look at that. How cool is that? Don't get any ideas. Is that... <laughs> no, because <laughs> you'll never have any money. I cannot afford that as well. I feel like you're a million miles off the ground. Have you been what? in the sea as well, have you? Yeah. yeah. Oh, so jealous. But it's well cool. This is the best beach to ride on. But it's well cool. It's really nice. Somebody else want a seat in? Anybody else want to sit on the horsey? Here go. No, do you want to go? Do you want to go, Leah? Yeah. Are you scared? <laughs> you were Come telling me you wanted to go horse riding the other day. I got you. Yeah. Horsey, horsey. Wow, that's really cool. Nobody else? No. No. <laughs> right, we'll go. Thank Bye. you very much. No that's worries. awesome. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye. Bye. How cool was that? Did you like sitting on the horsey? You don't get to do that every day, do you? No. Come to walk, come for a walk in the woods and then get to sit on a horse. That was really, really cool. Really cool. And they didn't mind being filmed, which is even better. That's really cool. Was that good? Mm -hmm. High five. Wish I could have got up on the horsey. Hey? Eh? Oh, Right guys, we are on our way back home now. It's been an absolutely lovely walk. Seeing the horses was amazing as well. That was really, really cool. So we haven't seen too much damage with the trees or anything. It seems like uh, 
didn't have too much impact on our nice little wedding walk, so that's cool. But again, favourite walk. We're going to head home now, and that uh, means I will finish off at home, so I'll see you in a bit. Zoe is tired. So um, it's eight o'clock at night. I uh, was editing the video from today, from Sunday, and I got all the way to the end and I realized we that we haven't the finished the vlog. We finished the video. <laughs> so I was like, oh, right, we better finish the vlog then. So that's why it's now eight o'clock and we're finishing the vlog. So all the little ones obviously are in bed. Zoe's been doing the ironing, haven't you? For, for, like for back to school. Ever. And um, like for at least. Two hours or something ridiculous now. And I've been editing my video and I was just like, alright, I need to finish that video off then. So um, here we are. That was a nice day, wasn't it? Yes. Wasn't it? I love, we love that walk. That We absolutely love that walk. I don't think we said that enough. It's lovely. And the horses were good, weren't they? Horses. Erin loves sitting on that horse, bless her. So anyway, that's the weekend done, guys. So another busy week on the way. Uh, we're not filming on Monday, but, but there are quite a few vlogs coming your way so we've got so you've probably already seen the Yultanic uh collaboration we did and then there will be sheen hauls this is how he's been doing sheen hauls there's a girls sheen haul and then you've done a try on haul haven't you as well it's a bit of both a bit of both try on haul as well so um that's that and then we're obviously on our on our on our week away aren't we so on our short break away which will be really, really good. So lots of vlogs coming, guys. We're going to try and give you a vlog every day over the next couple of weeks anyway, while I'm off work. So we'll see how it goes. Well, that's it, guys. Should we finish the vlog quickly? And going as well. That's it, guys. Uh, really hope you enjoyed today's vlog. Please subscribe to our channel. Please hit the bell for notifications. Drop us a like. Uh, don't forget our link tree in the video description below for all of our social media, our Facebook, Instagram and TikTok. And that just leaves us both to say thank you for supporting us. Thanks for watching guys and we'll see you in the next video. Bye.